What is up you guys? It's Lydia here and for today's video I'm going to be taking you through a cardio and abs workout. This is going to be a lot of fun and there is no equipment needed so it's just really great for like anyone who whether you're traveling you don't have equipment or you just don't have equipment at your home and you want something just quick and fun to get your energy up, get your mood boosted and just have a good time this workout's for you. So for this workout, there's actually no repeats the entire time. We just have like a bunch of different moves going through. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, definitely high cardio, lots of jumping, moving, having fun. I'll be giving you modifications throughout if you don't want to jump or if it moves a bit too advanced. Um, but without further ado, let's dive into the warm up. So for the first warm up move, grab something to hold on to and let's just do some front back kicks. So as you can see, I'm kicking forward and back. My hips are staying square, and you're feeling that stretch in your hamstrings and in your hip flexor. Just front and back, getting a really good stretch. So you're gonna feel that in your hamstrings as you kick forward, and when you kick back, you're gonna feel it in your hip flexor. Making sure that your hips are staying nice and squared so you're not doing this, okay? Alrighty, switch sides. Kick forward and back. Really good stretch. We're going to be using our legs a lot today. We're going to have some fun. Start your breathing now. Inhale and exhale. Alrighty, so now we're gonna do some crossbody punches. Really, really simple. Pivoting that foot as you punch, feeling a nice twist in your spine, and then as you punch, really warming up your upper body. Now really feeling your abs kind of turning on, feeling a little twist in there, because we're gonna use our abs a lot today. Alrighty, now let's just do some whoo, some knee hugs. Pull it in, pull it in. Really squeezing your abs here, feeling that stretch. Really using your balance, kind of waking that up, waking up your core. Three. Two, one. Already come to the top of your mat. You're gonna crawl it out and then bring your hips to the ground for a seal. Come up, crawl it back. And just continue doing that, warming up your upper body and stretching out your low back. Let's do one more. Crawl it out, hips to the ground. Okay, final one, stay down here. Go into a seal and then push up, downward dog. Warming up your calves here. Like I said, we're gonna do jumping a lot today. So they're definitely gonna be worked. One more, so seal and downward dog. Alrighty, so the first move we have today is gonna to be a squat to a little twist. So you're gonna go squat, come up, twist. Modification would just be squat, toe tap. So you're still using those abs as like a little twist, but it's taking the jumping out, okay? Grab a drink of water, we go in five seconds. Alrighty, let's go. Squat, twist. Really feeling that rotation in your core. We're here for 45 seconds. Making sure that your abs are in tight. So you're not just twisting. Your abs are in tight. Feeling that rotation. Get nice and low in your squat. I don't want this to just be it here. Okay, your squat, twist. 15 seconds left. You don't have to twist 
super far. Just as far as you're comfortable with, okay? Three, two, and one. Next move. We have a commando to two knees and a plank. Onto your elbows, come up, two knee drives. Let's go. Down, down, up, up, knee, knee. Working your abs here and a little bit of cardio. Keep them in tight. Keep breathing for me. You got 20 seconds left. Come on guys, you're doing awesome. I know this one's challenging. Five seconds left. And relax. Okay, next one is very simple. We're just doing side shuffles, okay? Modification would just be staying grounded. Okay, here we go. So you're just doing a little shuffle to the side. See if you can get a little bit low with your knees, with your legs, feeling in your legs a bit more. Make sure that you don't come here and just rest, okay? As soon as you can, transition over. And modification would just look like this, okay? It's just a low squat walk. 15 seconds left. Abs are in tight, nice and low. Five, come on more. Five more seconds. And relax. Okay, next we have side to side in outs. So for this, seated like this, you're gonna go side on your hip, come in, side on the other hip. Let's go. Extending your legs, pulling them in. Switch hips, pulling them in. So you're on your glute, switching every other time. Feeling that crunch and really squeezing your abs as your legs extend, okay? So you're on the side of your glute. You're not in the front here, in the middle doing this. It's side to side. 10 seconds left. And one. Okay guys, next basic burpees, everybody's favorite. Stomach to the ground, modification. Take out the jump and just step it in, okay? Three, two, one, let's go. Nice and fast burpees, okay? Modification would just look like this. Woo. So you're just stepping it in, lowering down, coming up, heel lift. Abs are in tight. Don't forget about those, okay? 15 seconds. Three, two, and one. Okay, so now we have a basic side plank. You can catch your breath here. Three, Two, one, come onto your side, side plank. If you need a modification, go on your knee. And just breathe here for a second. At the halfway point, we'll switch. So you only have a few seconds left. Come on, guys. Three, two, one, switch sides, okay? work in your obliques. You got about 10 seconds left. Come on, you're doing awesome. Keep breathing. 
breathing for me. Three, two, and one. Whew. Getting those obliques on fire. Okay, so now we have, you're in a pike like this. You're gonna go one, two, three, four, shuffling your feet. And you're gonna go one, two, three, four. Okay, here we go. Shuffle your feet four times, then hamstring kick four times. Working your shoulders, also getting that cardio up. And make sure to keep your abs in tight here. And if you need to take out the jump, You'd be right here and then just tap your toe. It's really easy to take out the jump for this one. Keep going guys, you're doing awesome. 10 seconds left. Three, two, and one. Whew. Shoulders are on fire. Alrighty, so come up for the next one. You're gonna go curtsy lunge knee drive okay alternating sides after this we have a longer break here we go nice deep lunge come up knee drive I said to alternate sides and then I stayed on the same side I'll just do a few more on this leg so you're supposed to be alternating but I did not do that for some reason so just alternate okay so it's lunge, come up, drive. Super easy to take out the jump here, okay? 15 seconds left. Soft landing. Three, two, and one. Okay guys, have a little longer break here. Just breathe. Come to the ground. So the next move we're going to be doing are bicycle crunches. Very classic move. Get your abs on fire every time. Whew, just breathe. Five seconds till we go. Let's go. Bicycle crunches. I don't want to see you crunching your neck here like this, okay? It's open elbows. Bring your elbow to your knee, twisting that upper body and using your abs to come up, okay? So if you need to slow it down for a second, get the hang of it and then go faster, that's fine. You might not be able to go as fast, but it's a lot more protect, a lot safer for your neck, okay? 15 seconds left. So there's no pulling happening with your fingers on your neck. It's just there for support, okay? Three, two, and one. Oh, abs are on fire. Okay. Next we have crab knee to crab toe touch. You're gonna go boom, boom, toe, toe, okay? Here we go. Knee, knee, toe, toe. Really? Getting a little bit of cardio, also working your abs for that support and stability. Keep going guys, you're doing awesome. Abs are nice and tucked in. Okay, 15 seconds left. One. Next move, we have four cross climbers touching your opposite knee. Come up, frog jump. Okay, three, two, one, here we go. Four cross climbers going to opposite elbow to the frog up. Okay, my hands are getting a little slippery, but that's okay. Working your abs and your cardio here. Whew, also 
muscle your shoulders. <laughs> 15 seconds left. Keep going, guys. Three, two, and one. Whew. Okay. So, next move. We've got some mermaid crunches. You're on the side like this. Straight legs, lifting and lowering. Let's go. Modification, just lift one leg. So, you're on the side of your glute on one hip, just lifting and lowering your straight legs. Making sure if you're doing, not doing modified, so if you're doing modified, just stay here. If you're not doing that, make sure it's not a here where your legs separate. It's together, lower and down, up and down. <laughs> you got 10 seconds left. Come on guys, you're doing awesome. Work those abs. Come on, three, two, and one. <sighs> Guys, we only have two more moves. The first one is kick throughs. You're in like a little pike. You kick one leg through, lifting up opposite hand, switch. Okay, <sighs> let's just go. Alternating sides, kick and switch. This is working your abs and getting your cardio up getting your heart rate up, working, whew, working those heart and lungs, getting stronger, Let's turn and kick. Whew. 15 seconds left. Come on guys, you're doing awesome. Come on guys, keep pushing. I know it's challenging at this part in the workout when we're almost done, but you can do this. Relax. <sighs> okay guys, we have one more move. It's just those mermaid crunches on the other side. We can do this. Three, two, and one. Lifting and lowering. You got this. Keep going, okay? Whew. I know it burns, but you can do this. Come on, guys. Keep going. You got about 15 seconds left. Your obliques are on fire. I know. But you can do this. Whew. seconds left. Come on, don't quit. Three, two, and one. Whew. Relax. Oh my goodness, grab a drink. That was crazy. Okay, come on to your stomach into a nice little seal. Feel that stretch in your ab, your hip flexors. And just breathe. Arch back. <sighs> wow, that was challenging. Didn't expect that 20 minutes to get so sweaty, but I did. It was actually a lot of fun. Just breathe. <sighs> Take nice deep breaths here. Feeling that stretch in your abs. Alrighty, come back into a little child's pose and just chill here for a second and just breathe. Alrighty, gently come up. Now just step into a lunge, nice deep lunge and feel that stretch in your hip flexor. Oh, wow, and congratulations guys, you made it, you did awesome. I'm so proud of you. So glad that you decided to show up today. I say this every single time, but I am proud of you. I really am. And I'm glad that you showed up, worked our bodies together, got super sweaty, worked those abs, had a ton of fun. Really fun time. All right, now push back and feel a stretch in your hamstring. I hope you come back 
on Saturday because I'm going to be posting another workout then. It's going to be a lot of fun. I post every Tuesday and Saturday, so don't forget to subscribe for just a lot of fun workouts, cardio, abs, strength. I use weights. Sometimes we do no equipment like today. Uh, I also do stretches. All right, switch sides. Starting with that lunge. I think on Saturday I'm actually posting a stretching routine. And I'm really excited for that one, so don't forget to come back for that. Yeah, a lot of fun stuff coming, and I'm really excited to share that all with you. Just breathe here. Oh. Get nice and deep into that lunge and feel that stretch in your hip flexor, the back leg. Stay here for a few more seconds, just get nice and deep into it. Alrighty, now push back, feeling that stretch in your hamstrings. I'm really proud of you, like, yes, I did post the workouts and I did encourage you along the way, but you were the one that pushed yourself. And for that, you should be very proud of yourself. You worked your body, you decided to show up, you decided to finish the workout. And that's something to be very proud of. Get a little deeper into that stretch. Feel it up in your hamstring. Nice deep breath. Alrighty. Gently come up. Let's just do some big arm circles. Loosen up those shoulders. Alrighty, now go the other way. Nice big open circles. Alrighty, relax, and that is it for today's workout, guys. I am so proud of you, and I'm so grateful that you decided to show up and work your body with me today. Don't forget to subscribe. Like I said, I post workouts on Tuesdays and Saturdays. I'm posting a really good stretching routine on Saturday that you don't want to miss. So don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next Saturday for another awesome workout. Or like I said, it's going to be a stretch. <laughs> Bye, guys. Now when the summer comes, when the summer comes